Hi everyone, my name is Isabella. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be doing a pack with me video. I am leaving for Disney World with my family. We're going on a week vacation to Disney World. We're leaving really soon, so I'm gonna go ahead and start packing today. I'm just going to show you what I pack, how I pack, and before we get started with this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you like it and leave a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you enjoy me and the content that I create. And if you wanna get notified every single time I post a video, don't forget forget to hit that bell and I will link my last video up here so you guys can go check it out. Okay so before I start packing we are going to Disney World for a week so we are going to the parks for eight days so I have eight different outfits to pick out for each park. We're going to all four parks Animal Kingdom, Magic Kingdom, Hollywood Studios, and Epcot and we're going to hang out by the pool some days and go to Disney Springs so I'm super excited to go. I cannot wait. I already went once already during this pandemic which was last month. I did do a pack with me video on that and two vlogs that are up on my channel that I will link for you if you want to go check those out. So yeah, we are super excited. It's just me, my mom, my dad going. It's me, my mom, and my dad going and I will be vlogging while we're there. I'll be doing vlogs every single day. So this video is coming out as part of my Disney month of videos on my channel. If you want to go check out my other videos that I already have posted, definitely go do that. I will link them. Um, so this is a whole month of Disney and by the time you are seeing this video, I will already have been back from Disney. I already have my outfits picked out. I will show you those. But yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and start packing. So I'm going to go get my suitcase. Let's go. So this is my suitcase. It's a Calpac suitcase. I got this from Marshalls and it's a really nice suitcase. It wasn't that expensive. I do still have some stuff packed from the last time when I just went. They're not in my suitcase, but they are ready to go and pack. I'm gonna go ahead and start packing my outfits on this side of my suitcase. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with these shirts that I will be packing and I'm gonna go through by the parks and which shirts I'm wearing to which parks. So we're going to Epcot. I think we're going to Epcot probably. We don't really know yet. We're either going three times or we're going two times or one. We don't really know. We have reservations for three days. The night that we get there, we might just go there for a little bit at night. And then Saturday after we get there, we're either going to go to Epcot or have a pool day or do both. And then Sunday, we might do the same thing. We either go Epcot, pool day, or both. It depends on how busy it is that day. But I did pick out three outfits just in case we do go all three days. So for Epcot, I have this tank top. I got this from Shein. And it's just a little thank you, enjoy, like, to go. It's supposed to look like the bags that they give you with your food in it. So yeah, I'm just gonna wear this little crop top there. The next shirt that I'm gonna wear to Epcot is just this plain high neck white crop top. And it's just a plain shirt. It's really comfortable and it's very lightweight. So I thought it'd be nice if it it's really hot that day. I also got this from Shein. The last shirt I'm going to wear to Epcot I got at Disney and it is this Mickey and Minnie tank top and it just says the most magical place on earth on it. It's a really nice tank top. It's very cute and it's very flowy and I'm just going to be wearing that to Epcot also. Then the two shirts I will be wearing to Magic Kingdom because we are going to Magic Kingdom twice. I will be wearing this tank top that I have to crop before we leave but it's just this burgundy tank top with some grommets at the top of it and I'm gonna crop this so it won't be this long but yeah I'm gonna wear that to Magic Kingdom and then for the second day of Magic Kingdom I will be wearing this Walt Disney World shirt that I got at Magic Kingdom and I think it's just so cool it looks very retro I love the colors on it I really like this shirt a lot so I'm gonna be wearing that I want to buy more of these retro shirts that they sell there now which I think is really cool that they sell them the next park we're going to is Hollywood Studios and we are going two times to Hollywood Studios so one day I will be wearing this tube top I got this from American Eagle it's just a striped tube top and then it has little buttons down the middle and the next shirt that I will be wearing to Hollywood Studios is this plain red v-neck tank top shirt that I cropped. I have some ideas with these plain shirts that will make them a little more Disney-like. So don't worry, I'm not just wearing plain shirts for no reason. And the last park we'll be going to is Animal Kingdom, and we're going to Animal Kingdom only once, which is so sad, but I got this shirt off of Shein, which I thought would go perfect for Animal Kingdom, and it is this green crop tank top, and it has little diamonds. 
kind of want it. I think it's so cute. I actually saw a girl wearing this at Animal Kingdom once, but she had it in like purple. So I was like, I have to get that shirt. It's so cute. And those are all the shirts I am wearing. Now I'm going to move on to my shorts. So I am going to bring two pairs of denim shorts. They're both kind of similar, but also different <laughs> in a way. Both of these I got from Goodwill. These ones I actually cut. They used to be jeans, but I cut them into shorts and gave them a little fraying at the bottom. And these are just really nice because they're high-waisted and they're long enough on my legs so that my legs don't rub when I'm walking around all day. I also will be packing another pair of denim shorts. I wore these last time I went to Disney in my last Disney vlog. I wore these denim shorts. These were so comfortable there, so I definitely have to bring them again. They're long. I got them from Goodwill and they don't make my legs rub, so that's nice. I'm also bringing these shorts that I got from Goodwill. These are just some light khaki cream kind of, I don't even know what color this is, but they are these nice shorts that are an elastic waistband and have a drawstring. And these are also long and very comfortable, so I will be bringing these. Then I brought these last time too, but these are just some nice high-waisted, long khaki. They're by the brand Mountain Lake. I got these at Goodwill also. They're just very comfortable and they're nice to wear all day. A lot of these shorts go with everything also, so in case I just wanted to switch it up and wear a different pair of shorts that day, they most likely will match the shirt that I'm wearing. Then my last shorts are my overalls. I'm gonna be bringing these. Yeah, I got these at Goodwill also. They're Tommy Hilfiger overalls. They're super nice and long. The pockets are really big and it has this really nice like front pouch pocket, which I love. So these I will be bringing also. These ones are harder to pack though because they're big and bulky and they're overalls. So kind of weird to roll up. Those are all my shorts. Now let's move on to pajamas. So I will be bringing a sports bra to wear with my pajamas. I'm gonna grab another one, but I don't have one that's clean right now, so I gotta do some laundry. I will be bringing three pairs of pajamas. I like to switch up my pajamas a lot. So I'm just gonna bring a blue pair of Nike shorts, and then I'm gonna wear this Wishes t-shirt with those blue shorts because I miss Wishes. I mean, Happily Ever After is amazing, but the Wishes fireworks at Magic Kingdom are just like, a part of my childhood so then I will be bringing this coral pair of Nike shorts I love my Nike shorts they're so comfortable and then the shirt that I'm gonna wear with it is this just plain Virginia crop top that I got at Goodwill and my last pair of pajamas I'll be wearing are these flat pair of Nike shorts with this Mickey and Minnie shirt that I got at Goodwill it's just like a vintage big t-shirt. I like to wear Nike shorts and big t-shirts to bed. It's literally what I'm wearing right now too. And that is it for the pajamas. Next, I'm going to pack some bathing suits. So I'm going to bring three bathing suits. I don't really know how many times we're planning on going swimming, but I'm just going to bring three just in case. Plus, I can't decide which ones to bring. I just got some new bathing suits from Shein. But the first bathing suit I'm going to be bringing is this mint green bikini. It's just like a scoop neck bikini. The second one I'm going to bring is this burnt orange bathing suit. It's kind of in the shape of the other one, but it's a little bit different. And then I have this black bathing suit, which is my third and final bathing suit. It's high-waisted with this cool mesh material at the top of it. And then the top matches. This is what the top looks like. It's a one shoulder bikini top and also has that mesh at the bottom. Those are the bathing suits I'm bringing. So the next couple of things I will be packing, I've already grabbed. I'm going to be bringing a sweatshirt. It just looks like this. It just has Mickey on it and it's a hoodie. I'm gonna be bringing this in case I get cold. I'm probably just gonna put this in the car with me because I might get cold in the car. So this probably won't go in my suitcase, but I will leave it out anyways since it's coming with me. Then I need a hat for the pool. So I'm bringing this DVC hat that I got a while back. I can't even remember how long ago I got this. It's been a while. It's been a couple years. And I need a belt for my shorts. So I have this clear belt that I got from Shein. If you want to see me get hit in the face by this belt, go check out my last pack with me video. Now I'm terrified of... I almost did it again. <laughs> Why am I slinging this thing around? I know it freaking hits me and hurts. And then I will be bringing three pairs of shoes. I'll be bringing two gym shoes and then this pair of Mickey Crocs. They're really dirty, so I should probably try to clean them. And then I am bringing my white Vans that are not so white anymore and are ripping. So that's great for me. I'm bringing these because these never hurt my... What? <coughs> Excuse you. These never hurt my feet when I wear them at Disney, so I'll be bringing those. And then I wore these last time. They're these white shoes that I got from 
Walmart. They look like Air Force Ones. And they didn't really hurt my feet last time, so I'm going to be bringing those too because they're really cute. And I think that is pretty much it for clothes right now. I don't really have anything else. I have a list on my iPad that I've been checking off. So I guess I'm going to start packing my accessories and toiletries and everything. Let's go ahead and start doing that. Let's head over to my bathroom so we can start packing my toiletries. They're pretty much already packed for my last trip. I just left them in my toiletry bag. I'll just kind of make sure everything is in there. I think i got to add some things. This is too low, isn't it? Anyways, <laughs> I have my toiletry bag. I am sitting on my knees right now. So, so I have my toiletry bag right here. Like I said, it's already pretty much packed. I just have to add some things and take some things out that I don't need. So let's just go ahead and start that. I have dry shampoo, face wash. This is good. And this is, some, what do you call that stuff? Shaving cream. <laughs> oh my goodness. Perfume. I need to switch this out. This one is empty. This one is full. This is my face tanning drops because my face does not tan long story actually it's not a long story i really don't know why it does that <laughs> then i'm going to take this little bottle this i just fill up with water and spray my hair every morning that way it gets really wet and my curls look better some sunscreen my soap i think i need more soap yeah i need i probably need more soap lotion need that leaving that in there i need some more of these little cotton rounds um i already have toothpaste in here this is my makeup remover Oh my gosh, this is my makeup remover. Um, I also need to bring, because we're going to be there for a week, so I need to bring a hairbrush. I have this little travel wet brush. I need to bring some shampoo and conditioner, because we're going to be there for a while. So I need to wash my hair. I have my shampoo and my conditioner. I kind of need to make sure to fill these up before I leave. I bring those with me and my hair cream is in this bottle and I will be bringing my razor I'm just gonna put it in there for now and then I have another toothbrush that I will be using up until we go so I'm gonna go ahead and pack my toothbrush that I normally use see if this shuts now because it's packed full but here's everything that I'm bringing and it shuts thank goodness there's my toiletries done and I'm just gonna put this in my suitcase so I am now at my makeup table and I'm going to start packing my makeup. I'm not bringing that much because you have to wear a mask anyways, so you're not going to see like most of my face. But I am going to be bringing a little bit of makeup. I'm going to pack in this Harrods makeup bag that I got when I was in England. I'm going to see if everything fits in here. If it doesn't, I might have to pack a different bag. I'm going to start out with the thing I start with first, which would be this. It's a soul body face and body bronzing balm in the shade light it looks really orange but it really is not that orange but i just like to use this as a cream bronzer so that's what i'm gonna bring it for and i'm gonna go ahead and pack the brush i used and this is the brush that i use for that next thing i will be bringing is this is the morphe x maddie ziegler cream blush or mousse blush in the shade peach out and i like to use this stippling brush for it so I'll be bringing that. I'll be bringing this ColourPop freckle pen in dark brown. I like to use this to draw on little freckles. It's really nice. It works really well too. So I'm bringing that with me. I'm going to bring some soap to do soap brows. That's what I like to do with my eyebrows and the little brush for it. And then I have this Urban Decay brow blade pen that I like to use for my eyebrows also. And then I will be bringing my lighter and eyelash curler for my eyelashes and my Thrive Cosmetics Mascara. I will be bringing some sort of lip gloss. I think I'm gonna bring this one by ColourPop. It is the ColourPop Land uh, Princess Lolly Lip Gloss. It is a roller gloss and I really like it. So I'll probably just bring that. And I think that's it for my makeup. Yeah, that's it. That's all right. Perfect. It all fits in this little bag. So I'm gonna be packing this in my suitcase. And put this in my suitcase right next to my toiletry bag. This is the next stuff that I will be packing. I have this bag that has all of my hair accessories and jewelry in it and i have some hair clips i'm gonna be bringing with me so i'm just gonna throw these in my suitcase with everything else and i have some of my chargers already packed up in this little charger bag so i'm just gonna throw this in my suitcase too and I have this little mesh drawstring baggie that I put all my dirty clothes in so I'm gonna throw this in my suitcase too 
I'm gonna go grab my magic bands. I don't know how many I'm gonna bring, but I really wanna bring this one. I love this one so much. It is a Disney snack magic band. And then I'm going to bring this Vacation Club magic band too. And I'm probably gonna bring this Spider-Man magic band cause he is my favorite Avenger. And then, oh, I'm dropping magic bands. Oh, oh. And then I have one that's already in my bag that I will be bringing. It's just a white magic band with Oh, the light's not on. I was trying to turn the light off. It is a white magic band that has gold all over it, and it looks like it has, like, gold castle, and it says where dream dreams come true, something like that. I have to get it out of there to bring. So this is the other magic band that I will be bringing, and it's just what it looks like. So I'm going to put my magic bands in my backpack. So I did forget about my face masks. I have a lot that I am bringing. I have some of the Disney ones, and I have some that my aunt made me and some that my friend made me. I think I'm just going to put one in my backpack for now for when we try. I'll just throw this one in there. This is just a mask from State of Sunshine Co. And I'm just gonna throw this in there because this one's very easy to just put on really fast. And then I'm gonna put the rest of these masks in my suitcase. I also do have these two little baggies that I'm going to be bringing. They're little pouches. I think they're just really cute. And I will be bringing these with me. I'm just gonna put them in my suitcase. And I think that's pretty much it. I've packed everything that I can pack right now. I think I got a good amount of stuff packed today. I do have my electronics that I will be packing, like my laptop, my iPad, my camera equipment, stuff like that, but I obviously cannot pack that yet. That will probably be packed the day of. So yeah, but that's all I can pack right now. So I am done packing everything that I can pack. I have my backpack packed, not fully, but packed for the amount that I can do. And my suitcase is on the floor. It is all packed and ready to go. I just have a couple more things to put in and then I'm ready. But that is pretty much everything that I can show you guys and pack today. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you stay tuned to watch the Disney vlogs that will be coming up. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Bye.